Hey YouTube, my name is Nick, and in today's video, I'm going to be unpackaging this PS Vita that I got from Japan. And unlike the other times I bought some stuff from Japan, uh, instead of using Baiyi, I actually had to buy this one from eBay, because Baiyi has a very interesting restriction where they do not seem to allow uh, foreigners to buy uh, PlayStation products, especially the Vita, they don't like to do it. But uh, without further ado, I'm going to tear this apart. And while I'm doing that, you can take a guess at which particular Vita I bought, along with the model. Here it is. Okay, pretty simple packaging. So it's still kind of a mystery. Uh, I do not want to cut this with a knife, just in case. I'm just going to pull this tape apart. It should be. Good. There we go, got that cardboard out of the way. So now it's just the bubble wrap. Here we go. So I think you can already make it out. I bought the 1000 model Vita. I got the sapphire blue variant of the Vita because blue is my favorite color. So getting rid of the bubble wrap. Oh yeah. Just take a look at that. Not a single scratch. I can't even see that ding that was on the that was shown in the picture. Like there's a little scratch right here. I'll put the images up as well. But this thing is practically perfect. Wow. You can see there, 1000 model. There's the camera. Yeah, this thing is absolutely beautiful. Uh, I unfortunately don't have the charger with me, so hopefully by some luck. Uh, this might have some charge. Yes, there we go. So I've never owned a Vita before, so I don't know what to expect. Nice. Uh, so let's look for English, because I know you can set the language. Here we go. Uh, is there Canada or Toronto? Uh, Atlantic Canada, okay, I think that will do it. Okay, set the date. Today is um, August 14th, I think. Oh, that's month. Um, okay, yeah. so it's. Yeah, August is 8. Okay, I think it's the 14th. I'll need to double check on that. I can fix it later. And I think it's close to 8. I'll fix that afterwards, too. We'll just head to 8 o'clock. Next. Uh, do you have a network account? I do. Uh, but I'll do it later. Uh, this will set up your system for trial use. Okay, wait. Yeah, can I just skip? Okay, wait, maybe I can...
Uh, country... Is there Canada here? I'd assume there has to be. Yeah, there it is. Uh, settings for network set your date of birth. Well, I don't want you guys to know that. I can also just lie about it. Okay, there you go, done. Oh, I kinda skipped it, but it also showed, like, parental controls. Cool. Yeah, that's the home button. I'd read the documentation if I had any of it. <laughs> this just came with the unit, as you saw. Nothing else. There's a home stream where you start applications, tap the welcome pack icon to begin. Uh, first, before I go anywhere with that, I would just want to check uh, the system settings. Uh, only thing is... Oh, that's notifications. Um, Ah, here we go, settings. Yeah, that's fine. Start. I just want to see what version it's on. And it looks like we are on. Uh, nope. Uh, hmm. Oh, here. That's where I check. Uh, I think this is where I check. Right now, it wants to connect to the network. I thought it would be here, like the PS3. Oh, system information. I can't believe I skipped it. Okay, so it's on 3.74, so... Yeah, I'm going to have to downgrade that once I get my SD to Vita. Yeah. So I'm going to custom firmware this thing. Um, But I won't do that till I get the charging cable, which, like I said, I don't have one. And this one has a proprietary connection. So, I ordered a cable, I'll get it eventually, but so far though, it feels very, very nice. This thing has Bluetooth, so does it work with Bluetooth headphones? It looks like it might. Hmm. Prioritize Bluetooth device microphone. Okay, well anyway, so now I know what I have. This thing is in really, really nice shape. Uh, I want to leave this menu. Do I have to like... Oh no, I pressed the home button, of course. Yeah, there we go. Close an application, peel the library screen from the upper right, from the lower left. Yep, there you go. Okay, cool. You can put many applications on your home screen, flick the page up and down to search. Okay, so let's, maybe let's just take a look at that web pack, or that welcome pack. So it's cool that it does have some built-in games. To pause an application and go back to the library, press the home button. Got it. Cool, that's in English. I would have to tap it. Nope. It looks like they've been waiting to meet you. At Welcome Park, you can find out more about the features of your PlayStation Vita system. Cool. There are some tutorials that use the touch, tilt, camera, and microphone features. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. By using these tutorials, you'll become more familiar. PlayStation Vita system. Okay, good. I'm going to have to go through this. Go to the main menu. Select the icon of the tutorial you would like to play. Why don't you try a tutorial that uses touch first? All right. 
This one. Let me try out some ways of using touch. Make the numbers disappear in the correct order. Okay. Doesn't sound too hard. Touch the numbers in order, starting with the lowest to okay. make them disappear. Sure. Ready? Go. Okay. Do I have to do both? Oh yeah, cool. It's cool that it's showcasing the multi-touch feature. Cool. Probably could if I wasn't recording, because <laughs> I'm at an odd angle here. Pretty neat, though. Why don't you try a tutorial that uses the camera next? How about a tutorial that uses tilt? Sure. Your chance to try out tilt. Do your best to avoid the balls. Okay, only reason why I quit on that puzzle thing was because the image was difficult. And because I wanted to just Ready? move on. Go. Tilt. Tilt to the left and right to move. Tilt quickly towards or away from you to jump. To jump, okay. Cool. Very cool. I'll avoid the ball. Pretty sick. So I'm gonna hit it and it will fail me. The yeah, there you go. Okay, neat. Why don't you try a tutorial that uses the microphone next? Sure. You'll need to use the microphone for this tutorial. Record sounds and then experiment with what you've recorded. Okay. Touch and hold any and hold anywhere on the screen to record sounds. Blee blue 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 blah. The sounds will be repeated back Try experimenting with different sounds you've recorded. Wah 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 wah. Okay, that was annoying. <laughs> anyway, so the mic works, which is great. That was funny. <laughs> Next, how about a tutorial that uses the camera? Again? Wait, so I think I did them all. Yeah, I think that was all of them. Or it was just mad that I didn't finish the camera one. Anyway, there you go. So it's got almost a full battery too, which is pretty neat. Yeah, no notifications because it's pretty new, but... Okay, uh, friend should have none because it's reset. Yeah, this shouldn't have anything on it. Um, and it doesn't, it didn't come with a memory card either. So, yeah, this is a, this is supposedly an expansion port, which was supposed to use for some, be used for some extra things, but it apparently was never used. So it kind of doesn't do anything. What does it look like in here? If I can get this open. I don't have any fingernails, so it's hard to get this open. Oh, but the Vita game card slot was easier. Yeah, so of course there's nothing in it. You can see here. There's nothing, but that's the Vita game card slot. That's where my SD to Vita will go. And, uh... Yeah, I can't get this other door open. Probably nothing special anyway. Yeah, I can't get it open. 
But wow. Man, this thing... This thing is really nice. I don't see anything wrong with this at all. Absolutely perfect. Oh, I did notice one thing, though. I'm wondering what this little door is for. When I open it... Um... Oh, okay. This must be where the Vita memory cards go. You put it into this slot. You can kind of maybe see the pins down there. It's kind of hard to tell because of the lighting, but there's some pins down there. So that's where the Vita memory card would have gone if I had one, but I do not. Uh, I don't have any games yet either, but... That's pretty much it, so I'm glad that it works. Thank you very much for watching. Until next time.